Hey everyone, Golden Ninja 3000 here again. Today I'm comparing the two 2x4 buildable bricks that LEGO has made as Black Friday gift with purchase sets in the last couple of years. The red one on the left came in 2019 and the teal one on the right came in 2020. Both of these were VIP weekend gifts, so the weekend before Black Friday, LEGO's Black Friday deals. And they were each free with purchases of $200 or more, which is a pretty high um, like gift with purchase threshold. So let's start by taking a look at them separately. So I didn't actually review the red one. I didn't even get it like during the Black Friday promotion in 2019. I actually just bought it separately for like $10 in like April of 2020. I really like this build because I mean the 2x4 red brick is an iconic like feature of Lego. Like that's, I mean, it, it's like as iconic as the Lego logo almost. So I really love this build. It's built pretty similarly to the teal brick, except just with some larger pieces because they didn't want to recolor anything into teal for the first time. And here's the teal one. I did review this one separately, so you guys can check that video out, but it's built in pretty much the exact same way. They have the same stand and everything. So the big difference between the two of them is, like I said, they're built like using different pieces. So the red one uses larger bricks. You can see when you turn them onto its side that the red one is using like these big like 1x10 and 1x6 bricks, whereas this one is using 1x4s and 1x2s. Again, I'm guessing that's because they didn't have any bigger pieces available in teal, and that's also why this one has a higher parts count than the red one. But the biggest difference is with the studs. Over here you can see that they use the one by one quarter circle tiles, four of them on each stud. This one just uses 2x2 two two tiles, and I have to say, I do like the look of the red one a lot better. The problem with using all of these little quarter circle tiles for me is that it ruins the look of the brick by just because it just has too many seams in it for me, whereas this one looks much more plain and more like a Lego brick, at least in my eyes. So I really prefer this design, especially because these are so hard to get lined up right. So yeah, that's the biggest difference. That's basically why I wanted to do this comparison video. Although I do really like the teal color that they picked for this set because teal is still a rarer Lego color. All right, so that does it for this short comparison video. Again, I just really wanted to take a look at those little building differences. I don't know how many people are interested in that, but I just, I really prefer the look of the red brick. I hope that they actually continue with this brick design. I think it's a cute, like, VIP promotion because these aren't, like, super cool gift with purchase sets that, like, everyone would want to own, but they are pretty nice bonuses, and you can build them on your own if you just want to buy the pieces on Bricklink. The one thing I will say is that $200 is a very high threshold for these sets. These are, like, if these were sold at retail, I bet that these would be about $10 sets, and for $200, I feel like you should be getting a gift with purchase that's worth a little bit more. This seems a lot more like a $100 or even $75 gift with purchase threshold. Maybe $75 is too low, but this is like an $85 to $100 gift with purchase threshold in my mind. Maybe even $120, but $200 is just really high. So if they do continue with this style for 2021's Black Friday deals, I really hope that they pick like a new color that's not as basic as red. I like that they did the red one because that's iconic, but I really love that they picked teal as the second one because teal is such a unique color. So I really hope if they do another one, it's going to be like lavender or something because I really like that like a lavender color. But that's it for today. So don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys with more videos soon. Bye for now.